Okay, so this video here, we're going to talk about flow along curve. So I want to grab a curve out there and just um, a circle will be fine from F4. And let's just say the circle is this big. Now, the next thing I want to do is uh, I want to determine what the length of this particular circle is if we were to you know cut it and roll it out flat uh, and to do that we just type in length into the command line and hit enter uh, that shouldn't work hang on okay the length here is 80.442 millimeters so I'm just going to grab that I'm going to copy that so copy and the next thing I want to do is bring out a curve start of the line will be anywhere around here and then I'm just going to type in uh, sorry uh, hit paste and that is 80.442 whatever it was now what I want to do is grab a um, some text out here and I'm going to uh, just bring out uh, any words like that. Bring them out as a curve. Um, you can bring them out as solid I guess if you want to but uh, I, I find that it might be best to, to do it that way and place it on the end there. Now um, once you've finished you know modifying the height and all that kind of thing uh, then we're going to go into the transform menu and on the second level of the transform menu you'll find a tool called flow along curve. Now when we select that we're going to select our objects to flow along that curve, which are going to be these guys here, and hit enter. The base curve, we're going to select near one end, so we're going to select that curve there. And the target curve, we're going to select uh, where basically you want this to, uh, to go. So if I select that there, then that's fine. Now, the cool thing here is that we can select our, uh, our initial letters on that base curve and just move them along and continue moving them. You can scale them up. Uh, you know, like that. Uh, you know, you can play around. You've got history enabled on this, and you can also, you know, take them on the inside there as well of the line. So that's a, a nice, easy way to um, to use or, or to get uh, text to flow around a curve, whether it be on the inside of the curve or the outside of the curve. Hope that helps.